The owner of White Plain British School in Abuja and the officials of First Bank of Nigeria have been at loggerheads over a loan deal totaling about 690 million 368,000 naira. According to the school proprietor, the commercial bank ignored a court order and hired thugs who chased away teachers and students from the property and took over the school. And I was told that uh, First Bank of Nigeria hired thugs, invaded my school, took over the school, and they chased all my staff away. That was on the 8th. Uh, on the 18th of December. We thought they were joking. They have no court paper. They have nothing. They have no even any, 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 any paper at all to show. And before this, I was going to the National Assembly and the National Assembly had already made it very clear that they did forgery. That public petition that they did forgery. The school proprietor is also calling on the government to intervene in the illegal issue between the school and the bank over a loan deal. As they were running, they held two people hostage. One Yakubu and my computer teacher, they held them hostage now. We don't know what is happening to them now. So I, we are so worried that the whole First Bank of Nigeria, Citadel of Trust, should supposedly are resorted to Togre. Resorted to Togre. So we are so shocked what is happening. They did forge the four trapped legal mortgage. And they say, okay, they should be investigated. The investigation is all ongoing, and they took the law into their hands, and they used self-help to chase everybody from the school. The school management had earlier petitioned the House of Representatives Committee on Public Petition over a claim by First Bank that it entered into a tripartite agreement duly signed by the school proprietor. But after hearing the petition, the House Committee faltered the claim made by the bank Basil Okafo, Court TV News, Abuja.